I'm Sergio and now we will see how to improve the detector to detect objects, very small objects with the highest accuracy. And this is good for you if you are building a project and you are trying to detect something and it's not working as you expected. So we'll see how to fix that. This is a general overview where we'll get into some technical aspects and we'll write some Python code, but we will see generally also what mistakes you should avoid and we will be using YOLO and Python and test this on many different samples. For example, we'll try to detect ants. You see there are many ants on this video right here. We'll test this on a drone view. You see we have high resolution drone view with extra small objects and it is something very challenging for the normal object detection because it doesn't work and we'll compare that on how the normal object detection and does and how integrated some more algorithm will perform. And also very crowded places. One is this for example that if you tested object detection on this one you for sure experience some very low accuracy normally and we'll do some experiments also with this one where there is a huge crowd. Why is this useful? For many reasons of course you can count objects on a very large images just think about a drone view from a very high or satellite images where you have very very small objects but you have high resolution images this will be a game changer in these cases when you detect objects with accuracy then you can also track them for example if you need to track vehicles from a very high drone view you can do this and then of course you can make the detector more reliable which is essential if you are doing this professionally let's go now for all of these we'll be using the YOLO object detection model now YOLO 11 from Ultralytics it might be different when you're watching this video because every few months there is a new model they improve so fast but it doesn't change much because the structure will be always the same and we will test this and later we'll see also YOLO plus SAHI which is an algorithm which will make a huge improvement for the small objects we'll talk more about that later let's now try test the basic version of YOLO on the samples that I show you right now I'm going to write the code from scratch. I recommend to follow along because I'm going to do this very fast anyway so that you can follow through the entire thought process. We first load the videos, we import CV2, cap, we now select the folder where the video is, crowd, full HD, and now we load the video, we put, we extract the frame in a loop, the copilot is suggesting everything already, so we go with that, and then we release the camera, and we close all the windows. This is a very basic code which is just loading the video. 